Hi everyone, John here for JPWHU TV. I hope you're well. As always, this video is sponsored by 3Retro.com. Please click the link in the description below that will take you directly through to the West Ham section of their website. You know the spill, guys, the retro shirts, blah, 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 blah. You'll be helping me out on there a lot. If you check those links out, it'd be very, very appreciated. Any, any purchases that you make through there will go directly to Isla's fight. So guys, just wanted to give you guys a bit of a heads up. There's a news break about a couple of hours ago. This is the first opportunity I've been able to do to get you the information um, that negotiations have started for Sebastian Haller which I'm very very excited about it's I'm really looking forward to this you know I've done some research since uh, the Ulster Hammer and I did the podcast the other night he's that he, look, he looks like a very very good striker um, I'm not going to go too overboard about it because this is still the preliminary stages at this point obviously of course um, the information is coming out that the fee is around about 40 41 million euros depending on your sources which works out to be about 36 37 million pounds which is not a bad deal for for that type of striker there are stories of course coming out that he's looking out for if any other Champions League teams coming in but also it appears that we have and I quote persuaded end quote him which is basically the, the deal that's ahead of him which is 110 grand a week um, with a potential five-year deal with possibly as, it, as we seem to be doing at the moment with an added extension of maybe one or two years and also there's there's talk about having a release clause put into his contract as well which is obviously the the hallmark in them um, in the Europa so the European clubs that they all want to have a release clause in there so the, the payments must be made in full doesn't necessarily mean that West Ham will be making those payments in full for that 36 million pound 36 37 million pound so we'll see what happens with that but as I say this will be very very good the just a quick update on last night's uh, friendly against Altrich I think you pronounce it or if it was the uh, Austrian team couldn't see much of it so I could only see the highlights but some very good goals excellent vision by Noble for the second to link up with Antonio and also very entertaining goal from Diop as well I mean the bloke was practically on the floor maybe we, maybe he took to heart the um, FA Cup 1980 video a little bit too hard and was going to replicate Trevor Brookings goal so yeah it's that, that made me laugh quite a fair bit watching that but you know it's good we've got uh, we've got the first pre-season win under the belt and it's been a while since we've won the very very first game so I'm happy with this um, the kit looks brilliant very very happy with how the kit looks in in so-called real life the talking of which the Fulham away ticket has arrived today so guys anybody that's going to the game drop your comments in the comment section below to let me know if you see me come and say hello it'd be nice to nice to speak to you speak to the audience properly um, so yeah also um, I put a Twitter up, Twitter poll up the other day about um, if anybody wanted Benjamin um, the Ulster Hammer back on the channel and it seems like nobody cares. So if you want him on the channel then Barmy's put in the comment section below hashtag bring back Ben. Um, so it'd be good to have him on, on there because I enjoyed the conversation. It was a little bit rushed. I mean to be honest with you guys I was very very stressed out um, Wednesday night because the central line was working the way it was and I, I as usual and I didn't really have a lot of time to get everything ready so I was pretty stressed which is why the video was quite rushed so next time he's on um, it's not going to be as rushed and the next time I have a guest on it's not going to be as rushed as well either so guys let me know your thoughts on the Sebastian Haller deal um, as I say I want to know what your, th your thoughts are that you um, are you happy with it we're going to be paying this large amount of money for this kind of striker is this one step too far is this not is this the f um, step we should have taken two years ago let me know your thoughts guys I'm really interested in, on in seeing seeing and hearing from you so guys in the meantime if you like the video and you feel I deserve it please click the like button if you like the vid the channel and you're new new to it and you like this content then bar means click the subscribe button to see if we can get to 900 by the start of the season so it's basically just over a month away so we're just under a month away I should say so yeah guys thank you very much for your time enjoy the rest of your weekend and you will very see me very very soon and of course share this content with anybody else that you know as well so you might want to watch it all the best bye bye